Hi, I'm Magdal Erasmus. I am a meteorologist here in South Africa. A heat wave is when you have a high pressure system in the mid levels of the atmosphere and it stays there for a, an amount of days. So it can either be uh, four days or it can be up to two weeks. But this system then it almost makes like a, a little cap across the surface. So then the surface of the um, earth warms up and as you know warm air rises but now as this warm air rises the high pressure is there so a high pressure is normally associated with subsiding air so this sinking air traps the warmer air then towards the surface of the earth and that's what's causing the heat wave so the other definition for a heat wave that's when a certain place a city is uh, five degrees warmer than the highest average of the year and that must happen for three days or longer and then they issue a heat wave warning. So if you take Pretoria for example, then January is the warmest month. So the average for January is about 30, 31 around there. So five degrees warmer, anything from 34 degrees upwards, that can give you a heat wave. So if that is for three days or longer, that's when a heat wave will be issued for Pretoria. So because of climate change, it is possible to get more heat waves because the earth is warming up at this stage. But the average temperatures will also be higher. So uh, instead of, for example, Cape Town being, if it's higher than 33 for an extended period of time, it will have to be higher than, say, 34 for an extended period of time. So the definition will also change slightly. We can also get heat waves during the winter months, but the winter weather systems move faster than the summer weather systems. So it's easier for heat wave conditions to develop during the summer months because the systems move slower. Every year, at least for the last 10 years, South Africa has seen a heat wave during the last week of September into the first week of October, or around that area. So, uh, you know, people would normally go, oh, this is a heat wave, is this due to climate change and all of that? But it is actually not. It's not unheard of to have heat waves during our spring months. And actually, it's, it's something that happens almost every year. The highest temperature ever recorded across the world during October happened in 2015 and it was here in South Africa. Some records are saying it was Fred and Dull with a maximum of 48 degrees Celsius. Others are saying that it was Fjordsdrif on the border between Namibia and the Northern Cape, which was 47. Those two are so close, it's very hot and it's hotter than the Saudi Arabia areas ever got during October. So that's specifically the record for October across the world.